The design of the bogey was developed by ICF Integral Coach Factory Perambur in India. It collaborated with the Swiss car and elevator manufacturing company Switzerland in the 1950s. It rolled out its 50,000 passenger coach and created a new record of manufacturing. In this video, we will learn about the different parts of ICF Coach Bogey. Bogey Frame It is a fabricated structure made up of mild steel channels and angles welded to form the main frame of the bogey. The frame is divided into three main sections. Bogey Bolster It is a free-floating member which takes the entire load of the coach. Center pivot. It joins the body with the bogey and transmits the tractive and braking forces on the bogies. It allows for rotation of the bogey when the coach is moving on the curves. Wheel set assembly. The wheel set assembly consists of two pairs of wheels and axles. Roller bearing assembly. Bearings are used on the ICF bogies. These bearings are press-fitted on the axle journal. Brake Beam Assembly ICF Bogey uses two types of brake beams. 13 tons and 16 tons. It is made from steel pipes and welded at the ends. The brake beam has a typical isosceles triangle shape. The brake head is fixed at the end of the brake beam. Brake Block Brake Cylinder In the ICF bogey, the brake cylinder is mounted on the bogey frame itself. Primary Suspension It is through the dish pot arrangement. Secondary Suspension It is an arrangement of ICF bogies through bolster springs. The bolster is not welded or bolted anywhere to the bogey frame. Alternator Thank you. Let's grow up. Never stop your learning.